Hello and welcome to Friday Night Live. It's Lamas Day night. We're doing llamas. So exciting. It's Friday night. Friday paint night. Woo woo. I'm a big dork. But y'all already know that. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Crazy Friday Night, where Facebook never works right on the live. Welcome, welcome. So, before we left a while ago, um, Wanda said what was wrong with my llama. My llama is blowing a bubble, like a piece of gum bubble, so if y'all were curious, that's what my llama's doing. So I'm doing a more intricate one, which is going to be this one, and then I'm doing a more fun one. I can totally see you. I've been able to see you from the beginning, so um, I'm not sure... If the problem, though, is bringing another person on, we'll have to see how that goes. Now, I would show you the original picture, but my printer crapped out on me when I was printing pictures out tonight. So, I ended up having to sketch. This one, I, ate, I was able to kind of put it together without with it working. But this one, I had to sketch because... It ran out of ink, and it didn't tell me it was out of ink, but I've been having trouble with it, so. Um, I'm, I don't know if I'm going to have to. I'm on the fence on whether I just want to buy a new printer or if I want to um, buy another cartridge. I don't know. What do y'all think? Yes, this is the most current live. Sorry, those other ones didn't get deleted. But it's a good thing I made myself a Bloody Mary tonight because I'm all chill about all this drama going on. Let's see if we can bring Wanda on. Now y'all remember I'm going to be on the left. Wanda's going to be on the right. We have a ceiling fan, guys. And I see comments. Yes. <laughs> Hi. Katie on the left, Wanda on the right. Yes. Yeah, so now I got to move my stuff. <laughs> oh, look at that. Dirty. Dirty. <laughs> yeah, that's why I put this paper down. Um, there's dirty. <laughs> dirty up here. Uh, there. Yeah. See? Dirty. Just cover it up. It's a bunch of dirty girls. I swear. <laughs> <laughs> Happy Friday. <laughs> so, so, what are we ahead. doing, Miss Wanda? We are doing llamas, <laughs> as you can tell. <laughs> so, it is kind of a how you want to do it night. I love this, so I'm going to kind of go with that on mine. Okay. Not the same llama, but they look kind of similar. Thank you, Nisi. And... I believe this was your recommendation, Katie. This one here. Uh huh. Uh, I love that. So I want to do that on that one. So that's me. And I think I want to use some of the new Sherbert kisses and some chameleons and, you know, whatever, whatever comes, whatever's on our hearts, we can do that, right? For sure. I was telling them that. I am doing um, a little bit more intricate one. With this one, I'm going to be using my Arteza gouache. It's blowing a bubble, by the way, since you were asking. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, whatever. Um, that's your. That's one of those balls, you know, one of those freaky balls that you uh -huh. buy. <laughs> and then this one's just a fun one. So um, I don't know if I'll get it all done tonight. I might get all into this one and only get that one done, but we'll see. Yep. I think that two is the luck is the lucky number. When you said you were going to do three, I was like, "What?" <laughs> well, because originally I was just going to do three simple ones like this, but then I saw this one and 
I just had to paint it. <laughs> so cute. Okay. Well, I'm going to start. Uh, I usually, I don't know. Sometimes I line first, sometimes I don't. So, but tonight I'm going to line one first. And that is this one. Hello, everyone that's coming back in. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Gotta love Facebook and their lives. You would <laughs> think they would do some work on this. I know. It's kind of like they don't care. I kind of feel like they don't love us. Maybe we're not big enough for them to love yet. Yeah. Maybe so. So I was telling them, I tried to print out my pictures on my printer, and oh. the first picture did not print at all, and the second one printed out in black and white, so I'm assuming my color cartridge is out, but oh. I don't know that for sure. It doesn't say that it's out. It says that the levels are lower, but it doesn't say that it's out, but I've had so much trouble with that printer. I'm trying to decide if I should just go ahead and buy a new printer instead of spending the money on new cartridges. Cause you know, the cartridges sure. that I get are, they're already like, I don't remember how much it is, but it's quite a bit. Yeah. I know. Oh, ink is I don't know. Crazy. It's like a hundred bucks every time I buy a pack of ink. That's what I'm saying. So I'm thinking I should just go ahead and just go ahead and, buy a new printer but I need to do some research and stuff because I don't want to get a crap computer again Com printer yeah I mean printer uh, well computer either. I mean yeah <laughs> I, I hear you <laughs> I used to just buy the Black Friday deals from Walmart but now I need I need a good printer like we need a good printer that's all there is to it yeah I know. I'm contemplating a laser printer because, you know, we sometimes we just need a laser printer, especially for like decoupage, you know, and stuff like that. I know, but I just don't know if I can afford one. No, I, well, I can't either. You can. Not really, no. <laughs> um, but if we, you know, had one for the business, that's different. Yeah. So. You never know. So I'm going to start off with um, kind of putting in my first layer, and I'm going to start putting in some gray shadowing around its neck and start building, building up its fur. I have an HP. I've always had Hewlett Packard printers and they've really been great. But this last one, when it decided to be done, it's like, I'm done. It just hit one of the inks. One of the colors, the black, just leaks. It just spill you it know it totally does i i it freaked out the first time i saw it it's just full of ink down in the bottom i don't even know how how is it do that i mean it's bizarre but it still prints the black ink is always the one to be the last to run out and you would think it'd be the first because it dang leaks. there's so much black ink on everything i print and i generally use black and white setting more than color so but I always run out of color very fast well see I was using um I've been using a uh Canon because I was using Hewlett Packard and I kept having issues with them so I thought this time I'm going to go Canon and this Canon's been worse than the HP's so it's like what the what do you do <laughs> So, hello everyone. Let me see who's on. Hi, Lonnie and Bex. 
Lorraine, Nisi, Luz, Bambi, Jennifer, Teresa, Teresa, Christy, Christy, and Christy. <laughs> Hi, Jane. And wow. I don't have a count on members now, so but welcome everyone and thank you so much for being here for Friday Night Live. For Lama Stay. Lama Stay. <laughs> I just love that so much. When we decided to do a llama, I was like, Lama Stay, we have to. <laughs> yeah. But then I found this llama and was like, okay, I want to do this one too. <laughs> so bear with me. Okay, I'm Baron. This is the what did I call this? The marble series, <laughs> the marble brushes. I think I have one of this set left, um, but they're the same brush tips as um, all the other ones. So I have unicorn, horn, and mermaid tail also. Don't you love those rose pins? Oh my god, I love my rose pin. It has like the <laughs> the little horns and I mean <laughs> my bloody Mary's the already kicking in. It has the little thorns and everything. I'm just like totally totally jazzed about it. It has the little horns. Yeah, no, it has little just, horns on it. That's just your little demon peeking. <laughs> yeah, that too. Nah. <laughs> I don't know where my oh nope that's cactus I had it over here earlier I don't know I love them all I just told Wanda I was like I have all these pins but I don't care they make me happy to look at them so <laughs> that's all that matters right I know it's really fun packing the orders too because we get to pick your pins Ooh. We're getting yeah. thin though, so if you start getting weird pens, not you know, <laughs> just they're the last ones to go. I've got more ordered, no worries. <laughs> yeah, and there's no guarantee you're gonna get any one particular thing each time. Um, right. <laughs> we we spread them out. We get we try to spread out the things that you get too. So it might be a free pain, it might be a pen. You never know. That's still too light. Might be a bracelet. It might be me. I don't know. <laughs> yep. That's it. We're giving Katie away. Totally just dropped my brush. I know, Bex, it's terrible. Yep, if we can't ship it in an envelope, it's um very expensive to ship international. It's minimum, yep, like twenty, twenty seven dollars, like you said. Yep. It's nuts. <laughs> But if you do have other stuff in your order, then we can pack it up and it does not, it's not as bad that way. Also, um, I refund whatever's not used on the shipping. So if my total comes to 15, then you get, you know, your money back that you paid. Here lately, it's been looking like people are getting about, the foreign ones are getting back about three. Yeah. Sometimes it goes over 20 and I don't charge you for right. that either. So 
kind right. of just a wash in the end. The believe it or not, the the foils add up. We I have like a count going and it's like I know how many ounces like foils have gone up to and I know kind of like what the top is and every now and then we get a order and it's like it beats the other order and so <laughs> it's kind of fun for me it's a little game it's like how much can we put in the rigid mailer <laughs> mm -hmm. because if it's under a pound that's um a better deal like if it goes over a pound then it becomes a package and it's like goes oh, way yeah. up yeah <laughs> like it's crazy dollars. how it's all figured yeah. out yeah crazy y'all crazy Good morning, Daphne. <laughs> How the heck are you? <laughs> oh, Allison, I didn't get the package. I'm sorry. She said it was out for delivery. If it, hopefully they put it in the locker, but I didn't get a notification. I ordered some keychains for Miss Alice and I was going to show them tonight, but I didn't get the package. So, oh, totally. It's probably my mail carrier. She was out today, so it was a uh, um, substitute. Those Not that there's anything wrong with that, but yeah, they don't know the, you know, because they, they come pick up my mail from my door, but they don't know to leave my mail. Hopefully, they left. The mail here in the locker and didn't take it back to the post office. Hopefully not. Yeah, our locker is at my house. Um, I know that's weird, but we have porch pirates, so we have lockers here too. Not they're they're like post office boxes, but they're bigger. And then we have like a regular box that's like a P.O. box too, but it's, you know, with a key, a whole bunch of boxes together. Yeah, that's what we have here. Yeah. It is a pain, but I'm glad because so far we haven't had anything taken that's been Amazon, but I've heard people in this development have had things taken. So mm -hmm. um, I'm glad that we haven't had that problem, but anything that comes um, USPS, if it's too big, it goes in a locker. So. Yeah. You know, we, we used to just have the letterbox on the front door, too, um, for a long time. And then people <laughs> caught on. It's, it mainly happened when Amazon came about, yeah. Yeah. So with the more packages being delivered, they had to do something because people were just coming up on the porches and taking the stuff. It's awful. 
There's like no honor among thieves, I guess. Most people around here have the door, what are they called? The cameras, but they whistle at you. <laughs> it's kind of funny. They have a broad view, too, because we go walking down the street. Like, we walk down the middle of the street. We don't have a lot of traffic, like, during the day. But, and you hear them whistle, it's all, <laughs> like, hey, thank you. <laughs> but it tells you that they're watching. <laughs> yeah, I've been thinking about getting that here. But uh, it's expensive. Ring. They're saying it's called ring. Yeah, something like that. It's kind of expensive. Just adding some furs. <laughs> Cute, Gady. Thanks. I'm just doing my first, um, my first little mm -hmm. layer here. And then I'll go back and do all my highlights and everything. I was actually thinking about putting a camera out on the eve, out towards the street, because um, it seems like a lot of the stuff that goes on happens kind of out by the driveway kind of area. And so I'm mm -hmm. kind of thinking about, do, instead of doing a doorbell, because we hardly ever have anyone come to the door. Yeah. But. I'm using Apple Barrel um, Black for lining today. I couldn't find my ink. I would be using ink, honestly. <laughs> I like this though, Apple Barrel Black's not bad. You're welcome. So we got like a little bit of rain today. Okay, we got a lot of rain today. Okay, a little bit of rain really fast, so it felt like a lot of rain <laughs> came down crazy. <laughs> like, the street looked flooded, everything like that. For a couple of minutes, it rained so hard, and then it stopped. But it was enough to bring the humidity up 7% in my room, <laughs> which makes me panic, because that's when my paint starts going wonky. <laughs> We try I will to do that, it. Christy. Go ahead. I was just telling Christy that I'll check it out. Oh, it's okay. I had a yawn. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't know where that came from, but it was a big one. I'm getting um, some allergy symptoms. I was thinking earlier, you know, it's like I always get them at night. And as soon as the sun goes down, there goes my nose. But, um... The with the rain, I thought maybe I wouldn't have any bother tonight, you know. But no, oh no, Jeremy's having major allergies, so you're not alone. Okay, I forgot to take my Claritin too. But lucky I take the ready tab, so I may jump up here in a minute and go grab one. 
So you guys don't have to listen to me sneal, sneal. <laughs> I'm not the only one. What's a word? What does that even mean? <laughs> I'm gonna sneal. <laughs> you would know what that is. <laughs> Sniffle is I don't know. <laughs> Too funny, man. Ay ay ay. You know, I think I'll probably be doing one tonight. By the time I get done with this one. My llama's day may have to wait. But I don't want to because I want to use the um, sherberts on it. Sherbert. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. I was having a Man Mandela moment you know what that is like when you feel like you, when you remember something wrong but you would swear that you were right and not only you but there's a portion of the public that remembers it wrong too it's called the mandela effect like when did nelson mandela die okay a lot of people believe it was in the 80s while he was in prison but no he died in 2012 or 2013 shocking what the heck's going on right Okay, so the other day when we were naming these paints, Kate, I spelled it, and Katie goes, you spelled Sherbert wrong. I was like, what? What do you mean? How can you spell that wrong? <laughs> Anyways, she's like, there's no second R. You know, there's no R. S-H-E-R-B-E-T. There's no B-E-R-T. So now my brain has exploded because my entire life I've been calling it Sherbert. And I'm sorry, but it's Sherbert. I can't not call it that. <laughs> and then I asked my husband last night, how do you spell it? He's like, S-H-E-R-B-E-T. I was like, we can't be married. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on right now. I'm like in a different dimension. Like I snuck over the line at some point. <laughs> It freaked me out. Like, I, I challenged Katie. I was like, no, you're wrong. And I even looked it up. I was like, look, yep. I'll show you. <laughs> and I said, she was okay, like, go ahead. Huh? <laughs> she was super confident. I should have known by that that I was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly. I would have bet money, lots of money. I would have, I would have sold the house for that one. <laughs> Oh. Is it a? T I know, Chris. Is it a Texan thing? I have no idea what's going on. I don't know. It's been Sherbert forever. I don't know what. I maybe my family just did said it wrong, and then I learned it wrong. But <laughs> I I've never even thought to look at how it was spelled. I've I don't, not that I've ever spelled it a lot, even you know, but. Yeah. I know. How many of you looked it up? You guys think I'm nuts, right? <laughs> I'll bet you guys thought I spelled it wrong because you know me and typos. I'm sure you guys have just gotten used to it. Nobody even says anything to me anymore, and I love you guys for that. Thank you. <laughs> I make typos in my store, on our group, and everywhere. I, I give up. <laughs> my thumbs are too fast. Like, I me too. So, no, my brain doesn't check before the <laughs> thumbs push go. Me too. <laughs> sure bet. <laughs> uh, too funny. Sure bet. It's sherbet. <laughs> See, I don't, I don't, I don't nope. Mm -mm. It's sherbet, okay? Sherbet. I cannot say sherbet. Sorry. Is it sherbet? Oh, is that where sorbet came from? I mean, did we get our sherbet from sorbet because we can't pronounce that? <gasps> Whoa. Now my brain double exploded. 
working double time. <laughs> I think it's funny because the first time I said sherbet, you laughed at me. You're like, you're not, why are you saying it that way? <laughs> oh, I was like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> I thought you And were I just blew it off because I was like, I don't know. I kept correcting her. I was like, Sherbert. She's like, uh, Sherbet. <laughs> oh, funny. maybe it's a Cali thing, but so many people on here are saying that it's not just me. <laughs> All right. Y'all get my attention if y'all need some because I'm like really in like hyper concentration mode over here. You're painting a masterpiece over there. It's awesome. I'm trying to find my... I keep looking at yours thinking it's me. <laughs> nope. Let me just try to pull my paint down here so we can see. Ha <laughs> ha Here. <laughs> Pink ears. I love it. I love it. So I'm using this for the inspiration. I'm just going to drop the color in. So I do my animal fur pretty much all the same. I'm not doing it real fine tonight since we're live and that would take way too long, but um, I pretty much put in a darker color first. And then instead of trying to just leave white patches, it's too, it's too much for me. So um, I go in and lay in a darker color and then I go back in with my white and then feather in my white. Uh-huh, I see. I'm fixing the switch to a finer brush, though. But I'm just explaining... Um, my whole fur deal. Take some of this out on the ear. I had a little bit too much lighter going on. I'm on the left. Yeah. <laughs> um, we had to restart because Wanda was having some issues. Wanda's always having issues. Well, but it's not your fault. It's it's for some reason it's Facebook. No, and why it worked for me, I have no idea. Because usually, it used to be that it didn't work for me, remember? Yeah, but it even sounds clearer. With, like, we're in, speak, we're in stereo or something. I think you really? might be something. Yeah. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. 
Do you guys feel like it's better sound tonight? I'm blurry. Oh. It just might be to one person, though. Nope. Jane says yes. Yeah. Oh, wait. Is that yes? The sound is better or I'm blurry? <laughs> sound is fine. I'm blurry. Okay. So one side. So it's the second person that gets blurry then. I think that's probably because we're sharing data. A signal. We're, yeah, we're sharing a signal. Yeah. And I don't have the the signal that you have, but but for some reason yours doesn't work as good, so I don't know what the deal is with that. I don't either, other than we're in Seguin and it's not, you know, a huge city. But it's supposed to be like my signal is super fast, you know, it's super powerful too, so I don't know what you know, I don't even know if it's my signal that's the problem yeah You know, I kind of picked something a little more difficult because um i haven't done anything like this challenging in a while and um i was really wanting to and so i wanted to kind of challenge myself so sorry why oh they were saying they couldn't see my llama oh Sorry about that. Mm. Well, she's doing watercolor, it's so it's going to look a little <laughs> smudgy like that until it dries. Fear not, my friends. It sounds like I'm fuzzy, like they can't see me. I am real sorry about that. I don't know what to do. Does that help at all? Huh? I was asking him if this helps at all, because to me it looks very clear. What does it look like to you? It looks clear. It, <clears throat> you're just dabbing in color, and I have a yeah. feeling that that's what they're just seeing. Yeah. Because mine is more detailed, that you're doing yours differently than, because I'm using yeah. Arteza gouache, and you're using watercolor, so oh, there's yeah. a difference. I'm not doing any detail yet. I'm just dropping color. Right, right. right. She's dropping color. But they're saying it's pixel related, so. Drop, drop, drop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Sorry. Okay, okay, okay. It's the pixels. Well, they put me I in my place. I don't have any control over that, though. I mean, unless we go out and come back in, but I'm afraid to do that anymore. It's if if Katie and I can see it, the recording is good. So when it goes for the replay, it'll be a good um, solid. You'll be able to see it. So if there's a part that you missed and you need detail on, it will be available when we upload it. Pulling out my fancy white pan that I got from Wanda. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna let that one dry and then I will start lining it and adding detail. All right, for this baby. Can you guys see this one? <laughs> I sure hope so, because it's lying. I can say it. Good deal. I'm going to do some stuff. <laughs> Nisa, you're going to seed it? You're seeded. She seed it. Yeah, and we're not always going to get the greatest uh, feed on live. Right. Okay, I'm going to let that dry a bit, and then I'm going to go back in and do some more work to it. Let's see here. This to be a little darker. A little bit of black. Yeah. I'm using the Distress um, ink in Salty Ocean to just do a little bit, whoops, do a little bit of Sorry, guys, I gotta get the camera out of the way. And then this is oxide and tumbled glass. Actually, I'm going to grab my little brush. My little blender brush here. Yay! Pretty, 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 pretty. 
You go, girl. I know. I go with my bad self. There I went. You can know how to do that. That way. Okay. Don't get excited with something. Wow, that didn't come out right at all. Uh, don't, don't you get excited when something goes the way you want it? Yes. <laughs> yes. I sure and dickety do. Oh, that's cute. Katie, I love your bubble. Thank you. I'm still working on it, but I have to let the paint dry and I go to another section for a minute. So y'all don't forget about our sticker challenge we have going on in the main feed. It's also tagged it on featured. So that's it's just a weekend so challenge. Cute too. Oh, I know. I fell in love with that sticker when I saw it. I was like, Wanda, keep. And I've seen one. I haven't seen, I've only seen one come back in already and it's awesome. I think it was Kathy Spitz submission. Very cute. I'm working on my eyeballs. Do y'all have any weekend plans? Anything fun? Or are you doing housework? I'm not sure what I'm doing. I think I'm working tomorrow, right? <laughs> yes. She's like, you're working tomorrow. <laughs> Katie's coming to your house tomorrow, so you are working. <laughs> well, technically, you don't have to work. I mean, that's why I'm there to help you, so... Yeah, but it's too much fun. I can't not. <laughs> it's fun working. It's not really work. It ought to be against the law how much fun it is. Isn't that how the retirement supposed to be, though? I guess. It's supposed to be fun. I I've always had fun doing the orders and stuff. I I think it's super fun. Oh, whoops. I guess I should have finished that one, huh? Dry, dry, dry. I think it's time for a new 3M pin. Uh-oh. It's drying out on me.
Oh my gosh, I love it so much. It's so poodleful. It's poodleful. <laughs> she missed it, you guys. What? I'm over here working. Dr. Pepper milkshake. Oh, you got one? Is mm -hmm. it good? Mm -hmm. I haven't tried it. It's ridiculous. <laughs> it for reals is. Okay. Let's see. So, I think I'm going to keep using some of this. Ooh, that's very orange. Maybe not that one. This one looks good. Yes, 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 yes. See how fast he goes. That's so cute. <laughs> Thank you. I love that, the outside. Me too. It's adorbs. I thought it had a pink distress ink, but and, and a little one do you? I thought you did. This is tea dye color, and the pink is picked raspberry in ink. This is the oxide. There, you can work with them together too.
and now vintage photo is a little brush this is my Artegria round number two watercolor brush oh I didn't think to say what brushes I was using I mostly use the mermaid brush and the little eyeliner brush and this what is this it's the magic fly brush that came with the gouache i guess i didn't even know that was in there <laughs> too funny and these are water uh, activated so you can use them with water like watercolor too the inks and the oxides I think I'm just about done with this baby What should I do with the background? Well, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I'm terrible with backgrounds. That's why I did this stamping thingy. Or stencil. Do stencil. You're like, no. <laughs> no, I didn't say that. I'm thinking it needs to be pink. Or purple. Oh, yeah. Do like a dark purple to a blue. Not that one. This Ooh, Wanda. What? What did I do? I'm loving it. <laughs> Thank you. Tonight you're on fire. I thought I was in trouble for a minute. No. <laughs> like, what I do? She goes, ooh, Wanda. I'm like, oh, God, run. <laughs> no, it's beautiful. Well, thank you. Yeah, my nose is super itchy tonight. Oh my goodness. Are my allergies rubbing on you? <laughs> no, I don't know. Um, but I did notice, I don't know what the trees are that we have out at the front, but I noticed they're getting flowers on them. Oh boy. So I wonder if it's that. Who would have thought llamas would have gotten us on fire tonight? <laughs> All thanks to Bex. She was the picker of the llama. <laughs> He's a llama picker.
I will be at Wanda's tomorrow. Yay. Maybe I'll make another video. <laughs> I don't know if we're making any paint, but a packing video would be cool. That was fun <laughs> making that packing video for Hope. <laughs> yeah. That was fun. I love making those sped up videos. Like the one where I was walking up to your house and everything. It was like, mm -hmm. so I had so <laughs> much fun editing that thing. Usually, I, usually I'm annoyed with doing the reels and stuff, but I, I had a lot of fun with both of those. So this hey, is, Lord. this is from Katie's favorite set. If you have it just to let you know, and it's totally filled with beautiful purple glitter. You probably can't see it um, mm. through the camera, but I can see it, and it's gorgeous. I wanted some glitter, but I wasn't sure how much, and this was the perfect. This perfect is barn door. I'm sorry. Now, I want a little glue, but where do Master I want to put it? Which glue do I want? Oh, Bex, that was a that was a, a set from a while back that was Katie's favorites. Fa Katie's favorite colors, I think, is what it was, right? Um, I don't know. I think it was just Katie's favorites. Oh. It was the paint. Yeah, it was a paint set that we made. I actually have two. I did a Katie's pinks. Oh, are you said... talking about foil or? Well, she she mentioned both. She said I saw a Katie's foil, but not not paint. Oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> no, that's okay. But yeah, I did a I did a Katie's favorite paint, and then Katie's favorite foils. And now I'm doing kind of a a set kind of thing where it's like Katie's favorite or. Katie's pinks. Did we put favorite? I don't know if we put favorite or not. But it's a pink set, and then next time I'll probably do the blues or something. I just have fun. Did we do the Katie's color sets more than once, or we just did it one time? I don't remember. What are we talking about? The, the colors, foil? Katie's colors. Okay, foil or paint? Paint. Just the ones. The one. Yeah. Sizzle. <laughs> I really just wanted to see the sizzle. That's why I put that one in there. The sizzle nader. The what? The sizzle nader. Okay. I thought you said the shiznator. I'm all well, that would work too. Shiznator. <laughs> too funny. Where's the paper? I'm going to let this dry and then I'll come back to it. So I can yeah. get started on this one.
that was, sorry, peacock feathers and seedless preserves. And I'm using Wanda's magical white pen again. Yay. Those were such a cool find. <laughs> Thank you, Lori Derda. Where's my picture? Lost my line a little bit here. It's called mowed lawn. Is that all the oxides or inks it's or whatever? The, yeah. It's the oxides and the inks. I did not know I was going to be using these until I took them out for my... Um, stencil and uh all the pretty colors just jumped out of the box so you know it doesn't always have to be about me and want to paint i mean there are other things right sometimes <laughs> oh yeah i forget because i do i am kind of in love with my paint i know that sounds really conceited but i love it so much I do get stuck, you know, <laughs> like I only want to use it. Yeah. The cool thing is you can use it with other things, you know, um, like i'm going to show you guys i'm going to use it with these so you can mix it with other water-based things which are the water activated things thank you jenny
called <laughs> beach what is the chameleons called summer boardwalk thank you a summer boardwalk I'll be adding some white dots also in a little bit. Um, did I post the llama with the flowers? This one? I'm pretty sure I did. It's, um, yes, it is posted and it's just a black and white traceable. Hang on, I think it's in my printer still. <laughs> oh, boy. It looks like this. Hang on, guys. <laughs> Big speed keeps turning on and messing up everything. So. Big speed, bad Big speed. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. This is in the original thread and in, in the comments of the event. So you can go to events, um, and then look for today's event, and in the comments there is this. I do not like Bixby, not one bit. <laughs> Irritating. And they put the Bixby button right on the side of the phone. So if you put your phone in a cradle, it activates Bixby. If yep. you it to <laughs> do it all the time. It used to be the power button. Thankfully, they moved that off of the side. So I used to turn the power off during lives, <laughs> <laughs> but luckily it doesn't hang up. It you well if you power all the way down, it would. But it it you come back on and it says you were paused or something. It says resume. Well, yeah. <laughs> Good night, Lonnie. Hey, I mailed your custom paints today, so those should be there to you soon. Yay. Mm -hmm. Oh, you guys, Lonnie. And I, I do custom orders, so if you guys want custom paint made and there's pigment that you have or you want to buy and have it made into paint, I do that. And let me show you. These are the colors here that Lonnie got. They are, this does not do them justice, these five right here. They are the most beautiful holographic and chameleon, and you you can't catch it on video. It's only to the naked eye do they do their thing. It's so crazy, but they there you can see a little bit of the holographic, but they're full holographic and full shifty chameleon. <laughs> Pretty dang amazing. Those are from 
Oh, uh oh, what company is that? It's the um, it's the same company that does the mood paint. What's that company's name? Solar Color Dust. Yes, yes, it's Solar Color Dust Company. Oh, so pretty. <laughs> Anyways, these are not colors that I carry, so if you want this paint, you would have to buy the pigment, have it shipped to me, and then I'll make it and ship it back to you, if that makes sense. Or I can buy them for you, you know what I mean. That kind of thing. Let me see if I can find this little black thing so you can see it. Yeah. Look at that paint. Can you see that? Mm -mm. I can't see it. Okay, look. Now look. See the holographic in it? It's not showing. I can totally see that on my end. Can, you can't see that now? Uh-uh. It just looks like a dim gray. Man. I don't have the link, Yvonne. Um, I can give you the name of it. Cosmos Zephyr. Um, hang on. Yeah. Cosmos, Zephyr, Whirly Gig, Voltage, and Kismet, K I S M E T. They're not something I carry, so I don't have proper links to that. But if you were to go to Solar Dust Company and look up their um, Chameleon Holographic. I forget what they're called. Kaleidoscope. They're called kaleidoscope pigments. They're there. Now I'm going to use Zephyr. which is a blue, green, purple shift. So pretty and I'm so ticked off that you guys can't see it. <laughs> Just in case you can, I'm gonna show it anyways in case some people can. Can you see that one? I can sort of see it now. I see a light pink and a green. But it's just because you're not clear, I think. There. Now I can see that on the, the right side, yeah. There's the shift. <laughs> too pretty. Oh my goodness, too pretty. You know, it's always hard to get chameleons and holographic stuff to even show up on video. <laughs> it's just, it's too much for cameras, you know? Yeah. I mean, unless you have all the gear, you know, the special camera gear and flat. We don't. We have our phone. <laughs> right. <laughs> We'd be working with, you know, we po I'm poor folk. I don't know about you, but I'm poor folk. 
we have not the right equipment. I'm going to come back and do some details inside these. Yeah, it would be awesome if we could have actual cameras and not use our phone. Right. You know, I could get a camera. I just, seriously, the cameras nowadays, Katie, are, whoa. You gotta, have a, you gotta have a college degree. Like, Hector bought me a camera a few years ago, and I, mm -mm, I cried. I had to go take a photography class to learn how to use it, and I quit because it's too confusing. And I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't do it. And all you photographers out there, kudos. Holy moly. It's a huge, it's scary. I'm feeling really old right now, like my grandma. <laughs> like, you know, grandma couldn't run the remote. Yeah, I can't yeah. work a camera. I can't work a camera. <laughs> Thank you so much, Lori, for your amazing, amazing abilities. <laughs> Grab links. And thank you, Jennifer, for all this work and help. You guys are some seriously awesome people. Amazing. Awesome sauces, you guys. Awesome sauces. Okay, I'm going to let that one dry, and then I'm going to come back and do some liner and details on there, but it's so cute. Hey, baby. <laughs> All right, let's check this one out and see where we're at here. Look how pretty that is. I know it looks like a mess, but look at the colors. Just the colors, oh, you yeah. guys. Look at, look at the colors of those. <laughs> yeah. That is the sherbet kisses. <laughs> I don't even like that. It has to be sherbet. <laughs> it's sherbet. 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 Okay. Back to the distress thing. Good night. Night, Amy. Good night. Have a great weekend. Have a great weekend. <laughs> Tony the Tiger. Yep.
Sorry, I had to pick it up so I could see. I need to get glasses. Oh my goodness. Or a magnifying glass. No, you need to get glasses. Tell her, y'all. <laughs> I have some, but they, yeah, I haven't. They drive you nuts because you need a pair that's not going to bug you. Yeah, that what she said. I need to go with you when you pick out glasses. Colloquially, how do you say that? Colloquially? Colloquially. What is that? Uh, Jennifer says they have colloquially May 24th, a long weekend here in Canada, Victoria Day, or as it's known, colloquially. Is that your, like, your Independence Day? Kind of? Memorial Day. Or is it the next weekend? Yeah. We got that coming up. Okay, I gotta grab a couple of things. I'll be right back. Okay. Right here. Oh my gosh, I'm totally off camp. Guys. <laughs> I'm sure somebody said it. They're probably like, Wanda, come back. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry, it took me forever to find what I was looking for. No worries.
Okay. Okay, it's not the best one. I did it quicker, but. Oh, it's totally cute. Totally cute. Oh my gosh. That's all the summer boardwalk. <laughs> it's so awesome. It's so awesome. Oh my gosh. Oh, I, I lied. It. This is my favorite red. The shiny red. Oh, yeah. Uh huh. From that I've had to get from. Yeah, and Mother's Day, I think. It's, it's on this oh, yeah. card. That's right. It's on Mother's Day, too. That's right. So, it'll look better once I get it resined and things. Now, this one, I want to put a little bit of foil on the bubble. Can you believe it, Wanda? I'm going to foil something, and you're not foiling? <laughs> Hey, I never said that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, I probably won't get to foil tonight. But... I'm just foiling the bubble. That's cool, though. It's going to be awesome. With the clear. And I have a handy dandy new. Uh, flashlight. I found it. Yay. Pardon my sniffles. Shoot, I don't have my torch. out my faithful torch. Thank you. I'm not done with it. Y'all know me. <laughs> I just had to do the foil first. I started out kind of far out since it's a new flashlight. I didn't want it to wrinkle. What a fun little night. Totally. With llamas. <laughs> Thanks, Bex, for the <laughs> option because totally. it was super fun and exciting and something different for us. Mm -hmm. I've never painted llamas. This is my first llamas. And mine too. So, eat was a good choice. I agree. Namaste. All right. Now. Bum, bum, bum. There's not much I haven't painted, I don't think, but I didn't think that uh there was much, you know, because I've done so many kindness rocks. 
but evidently there is. Have you done a swap? A what? Swap. A squaff? No, a sloth. You know those animals that are very slow and they're sleepy. A sloth. Oh yeah, a sloth. You did? Yes. What? <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I, I did a sloth and it turned out really cool. Sweet. If I can find it, I'll show y'all. I did it for. I did it for a lady. And uh, she never picked it up. Oh no. So I still have it. These pens are so awesome. Yay. <laughs> I did it again, oh my gosh. <laughs> what? I signed my name wrong. That's okay. There, what it's wrong. Going? Don't say oh, nothing. I don't even know what that was. That's not even my name. <laughs> That's actors. <laughs> I swear I haven't been signing his for a long time, but. <laughs> Whoa. Here, I'm going to try it again, okay? There we go. <laughs> Takes a minute sometimes to remember. That means you're not painting enough. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> And I'm going to have to go on a glitterific shopping spree. Uh-oh. Look out, glitterific. Uh. <laughs> I'm getting low on certain colors. Or all the people that don't care for their glitterific and they don't like it, Send it this way. Because <laughs> I know there's a lot of people that hate it, but I love it. Give it to me, baby. Katie, I found that I have a small stash of glitterific. Teresa asked, can I ask you how you all figured out your signature? Oh, uh, <laughs> the signature situation was a little hairy, but I finally Not got mine. it. I figured mine out. Um, it's my initials. I just was playing around with it for a few months, a couple years ago, and then I settled on it. And somebody sent me a picture of it and told me it's a symbol. It's tech. It's actually a symbol. Um, and it means like everlasting friendship and, or, like, um, new beginnings, eternity, or life renewal stuff like that. So I'm like, that's pretty cool. I'll I'll take that. <laughs> And then I researched the origination of the symbol after I found that out. And it's not controversial, but it's debated, like whether it is or is not a um, 
what the heck is the name of the symbol? The um <laughs> How can you not love glitterific? How can you not love it? <laughs> That's beautiful, Katie. Oh my gosh, bling bling and love it. I feel refreshed. Thank y'all for this wonderful night of painting. I can go um, to Wanda's feeling refreshed and ready to pack orders. <laughs> it's not my, that bad. Let me see. Let me find something to sign my name with. Mine is shorthand for Katie. And I add a little heart to it. I've seen some cool ones. I've gotten a few rocks from people and I have seen some cool signatures. And then some people just sign their whole name. Which is cool too. Yeah. Get my white pen. I'm going to let these dry since I made them pretty wet. After you've used your watercolors in the pans, it's probably a good idea that you leave them out and let them dry good because they'll stay soft if you close the lid. I discovered that little tidbit of information on my own. Ooh, has anyone used their cones yet? I used one finally and it was cool. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, let me see if I can find that sloth. Give me a second while you're finishing. Thanks, guys. Yay. Yes, guys, get your postcards here. I am so low. <laughs> I bought some, but they're not the same as, you know, when you guys send them and then we send those to new people. That's the best. And then I actually finally got, um, I got one back. <laughs> So we're starting to finally now get the recycled, which is the coolest ever, because they get to go again. Okay, here's my sloth. Mm. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Katie. What? It's the most adorable thing I've ever seen. Look at that face. Oh, baby. That's so cute. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. So I still have him. Oh, you. Girl, that's good. That's a good one. I'd have trouble parting with that. <laughs> <laughs> that's the way I do my hair on animals. I with a really fine brush when I have time. And it takes a long time, but it just makes such a difference. So gorgeous.
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hair is very hard, but once I learned to put a base color in first and then start adding different colors, it made a huge difference. And you use a really fine brush like those uh, mermaid brushes or unicorn, whichever ones you have, are excellent for doing hair, fur, hair, any of that stuff. Excellent. Did anybody paint with us tonight? I hope I see lots of... Um, she wants to know which brushes um, Bex does. Which ones? Your mermaid ones. Yeah, the... I'm Bex looking the, for it. The ones that are in the shop. Here, I don't know like where this. I stuck it. Like this? Yeah, I use, I don't use the real short one usually. I use the longer one and the medium one. This is the medium right here. So it's super fine. I'm sorry. I just had that thing. I must have dropped it. Y'all know I'm a hot mess. <laughs> I can't do anything without losing it or dropping it or... Yes, you can. You keep this place organized, sort of. Well, you do when you're here. <laughs> and then she leaves and it goes to tornado. <laughs> well, I leave after doing a bunch of orders and leave the mess. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Nah, it's cool. I'd rather have, you know, you guys getting your orders than a clean room, honest to goodness. What kind of paint pen are you using? Your cactus pen. <laughs> yeah. It's the same. Okay. The, the pens are the same ink and liner. The pens I have in my store. Um, they're 0. 0.5 for the character pens. And then the new avocado pens that I just put in are 0.38 so they're even thinner if you're looking for an even thinner line which is just ridiculous <laughs> get you an avocado they're so cute these are already super fine but yeah if you need a fine fine line they're good ones they you do have to seal them so after you do all this work you need to spray if you're going to resin here's the biggie this is the one with the super fine line. I love my avocado pins. <laughs> so cute. I don't even think I told you guys about those. I just snuck them in the shop today <laughs> or yesterday. Whenever I did that. But this I one's my favorite. Thing. That's big, yeah. That's a big. You see the bigger one? <laughs> those are the ones that are right that I put in the store. <laughs> so cute. And they're all different. They all have different expressions. Some have a leaf on the head, some don't, some. <laughs> and here's my rose, but we're we're almost out of those, aren't we? Um, those were free gifts. Yeah, I stuck them up there, so you guys probably got some of those recently in your packages. And my unicorn. I have way too many decorative pins here. But that's okay. <laughs> it looks like I have super cute things in my pin holder now. I could make a little vase of flowers. Oh, uh, yeah. They do. They make me so happy. Oh, I put it in my pin holder. Huh. This is the oh one God, that I use where a lot. It's supposed to be. <laughs> I just opened my pen thing and I'm like, there's my brush. <laughs> and 
it's multicolor. So one side is like this pinkish red color and the other side's like a blue green color. It's really cool. You know, when you have cute little okay. silly, silly things like that, doesn't it just make you feel better when you use it? Heck yeah. It just, I don't know. I have a backup set too. This is the, the backup set here. That I haven't needed yet. I'm really rough on brushes, but um, these have been holding out pretty good. <laughs> so I'm finished. Yay. Woohoo. I loved these. This was so much fun, you guys. Oh, oh, oh awesome. one, one more thing. I know these are like supposed to be llama hooves, you know, praying, but wouldn't it be cooler? Not that praying's bad, but wouldn't it be cooler if uh, Mr. or Mrs., if the llama was holding a crystal? Oh, yeah. Yeah, right? Yeah, yes, sweet. So I have to give the llama a crystal. I just did extreme glitter so that the the little hooves would stand out. I like it. Now I can't find one. <laughs> no, I don't know where they are. Of course. Mm -hmm. Boom. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. Oh, cute. <laughs> yes. See, we can't forget about the crystals. They're awesome. Use them if you got them. Yeah, I, I got to locate mine. <laughs> Since I rearranged, I don't know where I put them. Put one in there. Yay. Super fun. Super fun. And then there. Okay. I'll put little ones. That was total fun. Yeah, now I'm, I'm like not even going to be able to, you know, give these away. <laughs> They're going to go with my 1100 sitting up on my thing out there. I mean, I don't give, I don't like to give them away. I do. I love to. <laughs> Miss Katie gives them away for me. Yeah, they might be a gift to someone. Yes, just maybe soon. Don't forget, you guys, if you are putting your art that you did tonight, uh, if you're posting it for credit to be considered for the, not considered, to be entered in the spin for a win, you're not being judged. It's a completely random win. Your name is put on a wheel, and then we spin. If you want to be considered for that, you need to put... A picture of your rock, your finished rock, in the comments of the event. Not this, not this live, but of the actual event that's posted in the event section of our group. So you go to the yeah. events tab, touch the events tab, it'll give you a drop down menu, and it'll show you the different events. Generally, if you're posting, it should be for the last event because the others would have already been done. So. Anyways, I just thought I'd drop that in there because we, uh, Katie, not we, Katie, um, can't possibly keep going and trying to find all of the rocks that are posted all over the place. So they have to be in one place, and that's the place. So thank you guys for your understanding, and thanks for hanging out with us for these lovely two, three hours, however long we were on tonight. <laughs> Happy Friday Night Live, y'all.
Oh, one more thing. I'm sorry, you can't leave yet. Two new set, not new, two sets of foil I put together for the 4th of July. They're set A and set B. They're cute, you know, they're just all of the things I could find that I thought would go good together to make um, some themed uh, rocks for you guys. So if you're looking for bundles, it's a good way to save 10 bucks. Uh, rather than buying them $2 a strip, you get uh, 10 strips for ten dollars so and they're super sets. cute sets i looked at them and i was like "Ooh, wanda did good yeah thank you yeah yeah i get some credit this time give me some cred <laughs> <laughs> anyways you guys love you thank y'all it was fun tonight <laughs> yes it was i'll see you tomorrow okay peace okay. out bye 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 you gotta end <laughs> okay <laughs> bye.